Hey everybody, I'm Jack7. I'm a professional extreme unicyclist who's been riding for over 12 years now. In today's video, we're gonna watch a new street edit that just came out from one of unicycling's best and greatest riders. I'm talking about Nemo Seedler's new Lisbon Street Park. This is gonna be a really banger edit. I've been waiting out for like a week to watch this and record my reaction. So basically we're just gonna watch this. I'm just gonna pause it and talk about the things that I think are really dope about this edit. Uh, things that really inspire me and I'm just gonna be really candid with it and yeah what you see is what you get. This is my first time watching this. I'm super excited. Whew, let's see what we got. Oh, I hope he gets that. Yo, I want to see more wall rides like that. Uh, wall ride tricks like that are just so sick. Uh, okay, I'm going to put it back a little bit. I also like, too, how all of his edits, they just come in with, like, some really, like, candid sort of B-roll. I feel like it just really gives off the vibe, and it's not, like, super cinematic, which I think is really good for... All of these Ray Legend edits are all these edits that Mimo puts out. I uh, I want to see more people doing edits like these, including myself, someday. Someday I'll put out a full street part, I promise. Okay, going back. Alright. <laughs> nice. Yo, that's sick. Please manual down it, or backflip to backfoot. Yeah, <laughs> backflip to backfoot. Yes, ledge combos, please. More people, gotta do that. I don't understand how he hops over rail either, like that's crazy. I cannot figure out hop over, to, uh, hop over rails. From grind. Yep, little, little bomb. <laughs> Oh, yeah, those, those are really tough. Um, like, first of all, landing in the bank and 180 out of uh, one foot coast or manuals is like really tough. So that, I really like that clip a lot. Oh, oh he's gonna hop over all of them. Okay. Oh, a little ding at the end. <laughs> Drop to grind. Oh. Yo, that's sick. What? That's so cool. <sighs> Once again, I can't figure out those fakey manuals. Like, that is so sick. Yeah. And I really want to see people do more of those where they kind of like jib or bump the first stair and then hop. I've tried them myself, but it's like kind of tough to do because it's just, it's very staggered and it's hard to like get that bounce. Um, I saw Kyle Alviani do this and uh, I believe it was Brainchild, the one where he collaborated with Eli Brill. Uh, yeah, I want to see more of those. I love that stuff. I'm actually going to rewatch that. Going back. Okay. I'm gonna watch I'm gonna rewatch that one. Whoa, what was that? What the hell? Half cab rev flip? I don't think I've ever seen that one. Dude, he's so good at manuals. <laughs> and rail rides. And Rails in general. <laughs> Jesus, man. That's so scary. Like, I mean, a lot of people are just watching it and going, wow, that's really crazy, that's scary. But rail rides are especially dangerous and really scary because if you fall, if you miss that rail, you just hit the rail with your pedal 
and because you're just coming down on it really hard, you usually just, you either slide out really fast or you just slam forward and you just jam the rail. So it's, yeah, whenever I see him do that stuff, it blows my mind because he's like really close to just taking a really hard spill. But I mean, I haven't seen him take any super hard spills. That being said, Mimo's like 6'5 or something and uh, he probably just steps over the rails on like, you know, us 5'11 guys, but uh, yeah, <laughs> that's just... Yeah, nice. I've been meaning to learn those ones actually, they're... Late back out of front foot grind is already pretty tough. Whew! This little death drop at the edge there. <laughs> Ballsy. And then he's going for the hill bomb. Front foot blunt. Yeah, nice. Hard 180 out. That's one of my favorite uh, kind of combos. Oh, is it over? That actually went by way quicker than I wanted it to. Damn, that was so good. But there were some really awesome manual combos in there. Mimo is definitely still top of the game for manuals and I think I think this edit really shows for it, especially with like the manual and then the fakie manual on that little like, uh, what do you, I don't know, like L mani pad or whatever, that was cool. And once again, the rail rides that he throws out and the grinds is just, just mind-boggling. Anyways guys, that was this reaction video. Please comment down below if you like this kind of video or you'd want to see more reactions or getting my take on certain people's videos or certain things in unicycling or extreme sports in general. Well, hopefully you guys like this. I hope to see you in next week's video. Peace.